um, I'm here, you know, to see the former Super Eagles player, Godwin Opera, who played for Paris in Germany, France, Strasbourg. He played in the Nations Cup and also played in the World Cup in 1998 World Cup. So he has vast experience playing soccer as one of the Super Eagles, former central defender and right fullback. So Mr. Godwin Opera, so I'm happy to be with you here in your home. And then I would like to know, because the Super Eagles are playing tomorrow, you know, against Lesetto in the World Cup qualifier. So what do you want to wish the Super Eagles? What advice, what can you tell them in tomorrow's game, 5 p.m. in Aquaibo, you know, you? Well, well, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, well, my advice to them, what I would love to tell them is, is we should just keep cool and uh, play the normal game. We shouldn't be in a hurry. You know? And uh, they, they shouldn't think that they are, they are playing uh, a weaker team. Nobody is weak now. Everything is, is stronger now. Everything is improving. Everybody is improving their, in their various you know, parts. So they shouldn't take it easy. They should go, just go all out there and uh, and bring back the, 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 I mean, give us the victory. This is all we, 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 we want. And this is all what Nigerians as a whole is, you know, is looking for this place. Because um, I can remember when we played against uh, Liberia, Syria alone, we thought that maybe it's going to be easy for us. But it wasn't easy for us. So we should just go there all out and. Uh, Give one represent and uh, give us the victory. We don't mind if it's one zero so far. We get we have the victory. That's the most important thing. You you play well, you play bad. What we want is that victory, that point, that three points. This is all we need. Okay, I, I would like to know one thing again. You know, I want to ask you concerning the the Super Eagles team now. There's one player they invited. He played for Bayern Leverkusen. We're talking about uh, Nathan Teller. He plays with uh, Victor Boniface in the German Bundesliga. He's a midfielder. So what do you want to say? What's your taking concerning Nathan Telly, this young midfielder who came to the team? What can you say about him? Well, he's new to the team. I hope uh, uh, the other colleagues, they should work on him well. You know, when you're, you're, when you're new into a team, and for you to, to, to blend into that team depends how they welcome you into the team. I hope the the other players will welcome you very well so that you feel free and uh, give us what you I mean what what he has. Yeah. Okay. So and again, the Super Eagles are missing one player, Victor Sina. He's injured. And then now, looking at that team, we have Victor Boniface. And then we have Taiwa Wuni, who just recovered from injury. So what do you want to tell us concerning that attacking position? Because we are missing. We have Kelechi Hanacho also in the team. So what do you want to tell Nigerians and the Super Eagles technical crew, Joe Spesero, concerning Victor Boniface? He played against Saudi Arabia and the Mozambique. So, and he really performed very well. So since we are missing Victor Osime, do you think Kelechi Hanacho, Victor Boniface, and then Tarawoni, can they do something to re to do magic for Super Eagles in that attack? Of course, I mean, every, whoever is invited is you know is invited to come and showcase himself. So uh, for me, it's a big blow to 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 to, to Nigerians, uh, for Sime, you know. And uh, I mean, if you are invited, which means you're capable, you're you're you know. Yeah, you're, 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 you're fit enough, you're good enough to, to represent your country. So, whoever is invited is there to deliver. So, for them being there, which means they're here to deliver, to deliver the, game, yeah. the game here. So, and, uh, anybody that goes inside anybody that, will have to do that something. Is, what, 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 what I know is that it's not about attacking, it's not about mutual, it's not about defense. It's all about the team. So when you're a team, you come out, you defend as a team, you attack as a team. 
that's I mean that's how you can you can get the winning. That's like so it doesn't matter that you're an attacker. Like I have an interview yesterday that they're telling me about you know our defense is weak and uh, that I told, I told them it's not about defense. It's all about the team, the whole team. The defense so starts from the attack. Yeah. yeah. The the the, def- the defense starts from the attack. If you are the attacker is in good position, making sure they are not getting the pass pass. I mean the defense are not getting the, the defense are not getting the passing getting the passing. I mean passing the ball through pa- passing the ball to the to the midfielders there. It will be difficult for them. So that is why I said the defense starts up from the attack. So we defend collectively and we attack collectively. That's how we can get the result. Like, I want to ask you, you know, being a Super Eagles right fullback in Nations Cup in 2000, then in the current Super Eagles, we have Bright Osai who played for Fanabaji. How do you rate his performance in the last game we were watching in the qualifier? Bright Osai, he played for Fanabaji. So compare with your time when you played right fullback. In National Stadium, Nations Cup 2000. Mm. So, how do you rate Bright or Saif? You know, I mean, he's good. You know, we we can't compare each other. You know, when you look at the way the football is played now, and uh, the way we are played then, it's not the same. Apart from that, when you look at the technology, let me tell you something. Check out the balls that they are using now. It's more lighter than the one we were using there. Oh, so wow. it's more faster. The ball is more faster then. It's more quicker than when we are. So everything, and when you check out the boots they are wearing, it's more lighter. Lighter compared to that time. Compared to that time. So everything <laughs> so is every the changing. Is, it's all about the technology now. <laughs> so everything changes. So the game is moving more faster now faster than before. Now, for me, he's a good player. I mean, he should continue, and uh, you know, he, he, that is what he, he loves to do. So, and if assuming, I want to ask you, if assuming you are in the position like Joe Special or the technical, we have George Finney there, we have um, you know Nigerian-based coaches. For you, if you are among the technical crew, which formation you are going to use? Because after let's say two, we are still going to play Zimbabwe. What can you advise, Coach Joe Special, the Portuguese coach? You know, you know, for me, I don't believe in formation. Okay. What, what I believe is your mobility. You know, what I believe is your strength, your technique. You know, you, when you're marking collectively and you're attacking collectively, how come? Tell me, how would you? Um, how would you? Which which team can beat you then? Look at when Barcelona was Barcelona then during the time of uh, when Guardiola was a coach was a coach there. You can see the way they are playing now. Look at Man City the way they are playing collectively. You know wherever the ball is going, everybody there is you know that is it. It doesn't depends on the, sometimes I don't even know what um, tactic are they using, what uh, form are they playing. Because everybody is moving, you know. Show yourself, get the ball pass. What if you see in football? If you have it in mind, see what, during my days, if I'm playing, I have it in mind that this ball won't spoil. Won't, I won't miss this ball. I make sure that this ball gets to my teammates. I will make sure that this ball, I don't, I don't lose it. I make sure that my teammate gets. It. If everybody have that in mind, how can you miss? How can you lose a ball? You won't. Yeah. Have it in mind that I will, this ball will get spoiled in my leg. I, I won't lose this ball. I'll make sure my teammate gets it perfectly that he won't miss it too. That is way I mean, Barcelona was playing that. That is way I, I Man City. If you can have it in mind, it will be difficult to be, beat, to be beaten. But most of the time, you, you, you have the ball with you. And if you have it in mind that if I lose the ball, let me quickly get it back. You can see when they lose the ball, you see that the way the, the pressure, the movement, the, you know, every, where everybody, so that they get the ball back. That is what. So if they have that in mind, these two things, you'll be difficult to be beaten. Yeah. 
So finally, you know, what's your prediction, you know, against Lesetho, the crocodile of Lesetho tomorrow, yeah. like Super Eagles against? So what do you want to wish the Super Eagles? And what is the score line? What kind? What, what, what are you going to predict? You know, for me, I don't predict because okay. I really don't know. I really don't know my team. <laughs> if I know my team, I'll predict. Yeah. We are still, you know, going up and down. Yeah. You know, but I know we are winning. Okay. I know we are winning. Yeah, so Nigeria uh, is winning tomorrow. Definitely, we are winning. Okay, so the Super Eagles of Nigeria, you can see the former Super Eagles legend, Godwin Opera, wishing you all the best, the coach Joe Pesero team. And after they are playing against Zimbabwe, after three days, they will go to Harare. So what can you say about the Zimbabwe? I think uh, that form will determine what will happen in Zimbabwe. Yes, so I hope they come all out <laughs> yeah. and get the winning and get the goals. So with that confidence. spirit, the courage to, to Zimbabwe and get the victory day over there. Okay, so thanks. Um, I'm happy talking to the legend, Godwin Okmara, once more again. And uh, it's a brother and someone who has done it all in the top level of football. So happy to have you here and talking about Super Eagles match against Lesotho. What can you Wish Nigerians and your fans. Uh, well, 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 what I'm wishing, I'm wishing them all the best. And uh, we should keep on supporting them, whatever situation they are. It's our country, they are all our players. Okay. So we wish them all the best. Then. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. So, um, you have heard it from the horse's mouth. So, we wish the Super Eagles all the best in tomorrow's game. But still remain, here's Daniel Osondo Formado.